there. Beautiful char marks on there. This one off to the side. Oops. So move this one off for a little bit. Rotate this one over. Let's take a look at this. Oh, that one's ready. You can tell. Got some of these zucchinis here with some on the grill. Have you guys ever tried these out right here? These are called organic tortilla land, fresh, ready to cook tortillas. 60 seconds, segundos, which is pretty much, um, these are kept cold and then you cook them on your own. All right, so 60 seconds on guys, as you guys saw earlier. Let's see how they turn out. So as you guys can see here, it's starting to puff up and you're gonna want to make sure that um, once it starts to puff up completely, I would say 30 seconds in, go ahead and go in for the flip and then uh, crisp up the other side. All right, so here I am poking holes inside the tortilla so that way it can be cooked evenly. Check it first. Ooh, okay, now flip it. Yeah, that's yeah, what you want, right? The, the pan's hotter now, so it's gonna cook faster. What do you think? That looks good. Come on, brother. Yeah. You want a quesadilla? Crispy. Here's some of that green salsa from Costco that I'm putting on the first one here. Now throwing on some of that red salsa. It's a two pack piece that you can get from Costco. You guys should definitely try it out. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Grubbin' with Ken, and today, about to get it in on a couple different things. We got four tacos here. It's not a challenge video. It's more of steak that was cooked, fresh tortillas, salsa, the whole thing. Let's get it in. We're just gonna go from right to left, and I'm gonna let you see what's inside here. Oh, you know this is about to be good. Let's get it in. I know this is the green salsa. Why? It's tangy, has a tomatillo flavor, and then you have that very pronounced uh, onion flavor. I haven't even eaten any of the meat yet. I'm about to get it in on the second bite. Here we go. Mm. Nice melted cheese, nice garlic salted peppered steak, and then the freshness that you get from lettuce and the onions. This whole thing's going down. We have taco number two. This one has a lot more char marks on there on each side. And I believe that it has more of a sour cream 
feeling on the inside, as you can see. Let's get this in. Mm. On this one here, you can taste the nice char parts of the tortilla, the nice melted cheese, the brisk flavor that you get from the onions. Oh man, that's delicious. Let's go for the one that has a red salsa. Let's get in. Not really sure which one I like more, just because green salsa, it's tangy, has a little bit of spiciness to it. Red salsa, red salsa has more of a tomato flavor. Actually, I think in this case, it's a little bit more mild. Let's continue on. I'm super hungry, let's go. Wow, super full. I had four really amazing tacos. Hit me in the comments below. Let her brother know what you'd like to see me do next or even challenge video. Until the next time.